can't start a tutorial without drinking coffee. Welcome back to the Franny channel. Uh, today, I am very excited because I am going to review the Dare to Create Morphe 39A palette. Look at all those beautiful colors. Oh my gosh. Look at that. I already have a primer. I already have foundation. I have um, bronzer, blush, highlight. I did my eyebrows. Going back to the palette. Um, so I want to I want to play. <laughs> so I want to play with like these colors uh, for transition, and then I'm not sure if I want to do like darker and then add this which is what I'm thinking, like adding this like in the um, in the lid. So I'll do the transition shades and then I'll add some of those dark colors and then I'll put this color on the lid. See how crazy I can get today. It's awesome. Let's start. Let me get my brushes. Now, uh, because I don't have anything to set the under eyes with, um, these colors are a little too dark, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the um, Excel palette and remix and I'm gonna use the clarity on my lids so um, I can have a nice base and this is the um, illuminator oh I am also going to include the brushes that I used for the face for the transition I am going to grab it's bare I'm gonna grab that on an M441. Let's do the other side. Okay, once that is on, we're gonna do the bottom. Morphe M408. I'm just gonna do it on the bottom with that same bear color. Okay, and let's do the other side. And let's blend. Add a little bit more depth. I am going to use, or should I go darker? Let me look at my cheat sheet here. Um, I believe it's cut crease, and it's that one right there. And I'm going to get that on a Morphe F39. Once the product is there, grabbing that um, Morphe M441 and then I'm just gonna go and slightly go over the lines. Remember to add color and then blend. Your colors will blend in so nicely together. Energy. Now this eye might look a little bit messy because it decided that it wanted to water. All right, so now that those two colors are in and that are blended the way I want it to blend, do your makeup how you like to do your makeup. It's always gonna be your uh, personal preference and how you like your makeup. Now that I've ranted a little bit, I don't see any fallout. So that is always very big thumbs up. So for the outer V, I'm gonna do expression, which is this one right here. And I'm gonna take that on Glamour Dolls. Change to a Morphe I33. All right, that looks good on that side. Let's do the other side. Whoa, turn this way. Now that I see, this eye is gonna be a little bit of a mess, so don't even look at this eye. So we're gonna concentrate on this eye. I believe I have the intensity I want as I keep blending and adding more colors to it. I am going to, should I go into that orange now? I'll go into that orange. So I'm gonna go into that orange. I'm gonna try it with this. This is just the Amazon uh, brush that I got. Orangey copper color is called Snatched. 
this one snatched so I'm gonna try and get that on this brush if I can't do it with the brush I'm gonna switch to my pinky oh, let's take a dive into that color that I've never played with ever or anything remotely similar to it so what I can do also is I can cut the crease so I'm actually gonna cut the crease and you're gonna use, look at my hand. You're gonna use a little bit of your concealer. You're going to do that line where you actually want that shadow to look intense. Okay, and now that it's tacky, let's go back into that color. See that packed a punch? So I'm still gonna use my pinky. Once that color is on your lid, I'm just gonna go over it a little bit to blend it into the darker shade. Okay, let's do the other side. And let's go into that orangey color. So once the color is on the lid, you're gonna go in with that dark color that you used for the outer V and blend it all together. Since I'm already doing like this orange thing, I wanted a little bit more extra, because why not? And so I'm going to go into spark color. Spark color is going to be this one right here. And I'm going to put that on right on the center of what I did right now. Now, for the bottom. We're not gonna do the same thing. We're not gonna mimic the top to the bottom because if you do the bottom part, I think it's gonna look a little too much and um, I don't want it to look too crazy. So the darker colors on the bottom, and that way I leave the bottom a little bit dark and then all the attention goes into the top part. So I am going to clean my little Morphe M138 and then I'm gonna clean the uh, Morphe M408. The bottom part, since I already did one, of, I did the bare color, I am going to go ahead and go into the uh, cut crease color and I am going to go from uh, my outer V all the way to the front. All right, once that color is on, I am going to go into that expression shade and I'm gonna clean my uh, brush and I'm going to do the bottom and I'm just going to go from the outer V to the middle. And I need something for the inner corner. So I'm going to go into that highlight, the Urban Decay, and I'm going to take that on my inner corner. And this is just an eBay brush, no name, no nothing. This is from Makeup Forever, the Aqua XL eyeliner pencil. I'm gonna go in with the Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced. So I'm going to use the uh, Full On Lip Polish uh, in Dolly and this is from Buxom. This is a beautiful little um, mini thing that I got. Uh, I want to say in one of my, it was either Sephora box or Ipsy bag. Uh, you can add more mascara. You guys can add lashes. You guys can add more uh, eyeliner. You guys can do more orange, more brown, whatever you like to do. I wanna go ahead and create more looks with this palette. Uh, let me know if you guys liked this look. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like this video, uh, subscribe, share, share the love out there. Um, 
But no, thank you so much for watching. Uh, but I wanna go ahead and do more looks just like eyeshadow looks with different kinds of palettes that I already have. Uh, that way I can give you guys different ideas. This is a really cool idea even for like Christmas. You can do Christmas with this. Uh, but yeah guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.